What is up guys, it's me Vlad and today we're going to talk about the beautiful, beautiful Christmas tree that I have over here. Nah, I'm just kidding. You can see we got new bows on the Christmas tree and whatnot, man. Looks beautiful, man. Uh, we got some uh, New Year vibes going on. And by the way, everyone, happy New Year's, you know what I'm saying? Happy 2024. I hope everyone had a good New Year. I myself went to church and whatnot, man. It was kind of fun. Uh, and though today we're back on the grind. So yeah, we're going to talk about the Gorilla Tag Cave revamp. And you might be like, yo, Vlad, what are you talking about? We got a cave revamp like a year ago. Yes, we did. But they are there are a ton of hints. There are a ton of teasers and kind of slash leaks uh, by the actual developers that we're going to get the next cave revamp. And it might be potentially really soon. So let me fill you in on everything today, guys. Make sure to like up the video if you still haven't. I uh, you know if you still didn't, didn't subscribe, what are you doing with your life? Go subscribe uh, or I'm going to go tickle it those feet. No, I'm just kidding, bro. Uh, but uh, whatever. So today, 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 uh, we have some important means to discuss. And uh, actually, let's get in the topic and get inside of the game. Yo, my quest missed. Yo, what? Oh, I gotta, I gotta set up the boundary. Uh, but yeah. So, so many of y'all might remember that for the previous uh, updates slash map releases, we actually had a few stages. So, uh, each update is divided into what I call stages. You know what I'm saying? So, for example, for example, y'all might remember that the actual beach map beach map before it was released it was on the first stage for approximately a year because uh the actual secret tunnel was uh, pretty much uh set there and uh, it didn't really do anything for a year but uh, after the map kind of got uh, made it uh, started rolling out and you guys might remember that actually same thing happened to basement in the city map and pretty much pretty much for that map uh, we actually got those markings on the wall first after that, we got a torch, uh, and after that, we got a door, which was kind of the uh, incentive that the map was releasing. Uh, and after a third stage, we actually got the map released. But yeah, so so same thing happened to, to the beach map, uh, which we had uh, pretty much uh, like um, this summer. And it's actually been the longest gap since pretty much any map released before. So you can notice that this place over here is something that we're going to talk about. Uh, but let me mute the music over here. Uh, but pretty much. Yeah. So many of y'all might remember that previously we actually had uh, pretty much uh, every map that was released. You know, there was kind of consistent schedule to map releases. And currently, even though there are the most amount of Gorilla Tag developers working on the game, there is kind of the least uh, pretty much new maps being released. Obviously, the last map that we got released was literally like almost a year ago, like this summer, man. It's been uh, last year, man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, and uh, it's kind of crazy. It's kind of crazy. And this kind of hints us towards the actual uh, cave. I wouldn't really call it a revamp. I think it's more of a new map that we're going to get. So uh, pretty much, yeah. And uh, I've gathered actually a ton of information on the new update and kind of uh, the possibilities that we have. So I'm kind of predicting that the next update is going to be the winter update and it's going to be in the next two weeks. After that, we're going to get a winter flashback. And after that, they have a pretty much like a whole winter to actually implement something into the game. Uh, so that's when, when I'm suspecting the yeah, kind of a new map is going to get released. You know what I'm saying? Because the uh, Grow Tech developers have been cooking something up for quite a while. And that's why I'm thinking we're actually going to get a new map inside of Caves. And because of a similar hint, see, similarly to Secret Tunnel, which was in the game for a year, we have this whole place which is dedicated towards the mines map, which is going to get released. As y'all may see, we have the minecart, and it's actually the only minecart that is inside of the caves. We have zero minecarts in the caves besides this one. Uh, and in the game files, the actual caves, all of the items inside of caves are marked under caves. And uh, these items over here are actually, you know, uh, pretty much kind of are I believe under mines section and whatnot. 
Uh, so uh, you can see we got the crates, we got all the references. Uh, and uh, even if they're not necessarily, they might be, you know, yet referenced as mines. But you can see this, this symbol over here. This symbol was in the secret tunnel uh, a year ago. And uh, it's actually the same sign. The same sign which was... Uh, pretty much the last stage to the actual if you remember pretty much a year ago We got the caves blocked off before the revamp and we had the same sign over here uh, and uh, pretty much that same sign actually had uh, uh, You know Kind of made its way back in the caves. I don't even know how so I'm suspecting that is the sign of digging happening so digging in that section over there uh, and if you guys don't remember, I know this is kind of confusing, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm kind of referencing a lot of timeline zones. Uh, but the important thing to notice is that, you know, kind of the caves became, uh, I feel like, boring lately. You know, caves have been kind of boring. And uh, uh, Grill Attack is actually doing a lot of dev work on the uh, new updates plus the AI. If you guys might remember. The AI, first AI that was released was the Lucy, which was released during the 2021, uh, or no, actually it was 2022 update of Halloween. Uh, and, and that AI actually was kind of revolutionary because every single person who played the game kind of loved her. And it, it kind of made big hype around Gorilla Attack, which incentivized more players and more cosmetic sales. And that's why I'm thinking that we're actually going to have that exact mind map turn into the horror game mode. Uh, and uh, you might also remember that in the basement, we actually have pretty much a whole new AI, uh, which was the second version of AI. Uh, uh, Lucy, I believe, was a beta test, kind of an Easter egg. Uh, and the, the basement map uh, is kind of uh, the second version of the AI that Grill Attack uses. After that, we actually got the third version of AI, which was exactly in the forest. Uh, damn, the forest looks beautiful during the nighttime. But uh, the actual AI was uh, the other ghost. Uh, and I'm kind of suspecting that we're going to get a new version of AI, which is going to kind of hunt. I feel like it's going to be similar to Big Scary. And uh, uh, there is also a possibility that we're going to get a new a whole new map on the beach so i'm suspecting what they're going to do uh, is actually make a, uh, a new map on each side of the map because if you guys might remember the city the city is so far away from a beach map you know uh, most of the people to actually get to the city actually leave uh the game uh or you know from if you're in the beach you just leave the game it's faster than uh, to go to the city themselves so I'm suspecting this exact tunnel, you can see it doesn't fit in into the kind of this uh, cave mines, whatever, uh, you know, section. It's just, I mean, look at it, man. Look at this. It doesn't fit in like with anything else. So that's what I'm suspecting. Over there, we're going to have a new map. So I'm suspecting there's going to be one in caves, one in the beach. And it just makes perfect sense, in my opinion, because of how kind of long it takes uh, for the next map to be developed uh since uh, i believe that uh there are a lot of grill attack teams split for example one team is actually split to do the cosmetics another team is split to do i believe the beach map the other one is uh doing the caves map and you no know, it's kind of a common process in grill attack game development uh you know uh, thing and uh, yeah, so that's kind of the whole thoughts that I had on this update. I'm sorry if this was too cluttered. You know, I had to voice over my uh, video that actually wasn't recorded. This video, you know, didn't record any audio, and I'm so mad. I recorded this video at first on my quest. The video got corrupted for some reason. It was 13 hours long, and uh, you know, it just got corrupted. After I re-recorded it like 20 times and then on my final recording that you guys are watching here, uh, the mic didn't work. So, you know, kind of, kind of cluttered. But yeah, th those are my thoughts. I believe there's going to be a map inside of caves and whatnot. Uh, so hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. See you guys later. Peace out. You know what I'm saying? Uh, and uh, yeah. Bye-bye, boys.